confirmation that the robotic arm is in motion. NASA astronaut Woody Hoberg is moving it to the grappling mechanism on the Cygnus spacecraft. A live view from the end of the robotic arm as NASA astronaut Woody Hoberg guides it into the grapple target. Again, he is using that horizontal line as a guide. These snares are going to close around that pinwheel fixture just below that horizontal guide bar. two meters away. One meter. Over the pin. The Cygnus spacecraft supporting Northrop Grumman's 19th Commercial Resupply Service mission successfully captured at the hands of NASA astronaut Woody Hoberg at 5.52 a.m. Eastern Time, 4.52 a.m. Central Time as the space station flew over Mali in West Africa, 260 statute miles above the Earth. NASA astronauts Woody Hoberg and Frank Rubio, who were on tap to perform the capture of the Cygnus spacecraft, are relieved from their duties. They will go on to their tasks for the day. They will pass operations over to our robotics operator here in Mission Control Houston to finalize the berthing of the vehicle.
Houston Station on two. Cygnus capture is complete. You have a go for Cygnus post capture reconfiguration. Copy, Frank. Beautiful job. Hi, Megan. Thank you so much. Great job by Woody. Uh, that was picture perfect. And we'd like to say on behalf of Expedition 69 to the NASA team and the Northrop Grumman team, con congratulations on the successful capture of the SS Laurel Clark. As we remember Laurel and the entire crew of the Space Shuttle Columbia, we remember that many great sacrifices have been made to get us to this point in human space exploration, and it's an honor to continue to push the needle forward in their memory. Uh, great job, and we also want to say congratulations on uh, the final flight of the Antares 200 series launch vehicle and uh, the arrival to the International Space Station. Welcome. Thank you so much. Those are great words.